Fam, I am very, 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 very excited for this vlog. For these vlogs to be exact. This hasn't been done in nine years. I will be in the sky. I'm very excited, guys. Thank God, our glory and him. Gonna be flying again, take a little small vacation with my tia, my tia Anna, my two cousins. Y'all seen them from OG Vlogs from vacation in Vegas. Like what we say, I'm gonna show everything, try to do the best I can. Cause obviously, you know, a little something different. I'm gonna be on the plane, gonna be out of state, going to Seattle, as you can see from the title. Honestly, it's a, it's a dream come true as a kid, you know, especially as a sports fan, you know, um, just being able to witness like a historic city you know, like, I'm just, it's, it's awesome. Obviously, like I see, you know, as a baseball fan too, you always want to check it off in your bucket list to go to every baseball ballpark. And when they told me that they were going to go, I was like, I'm going to. I got to take advantage of this to, try to cross up T-Mobile Park, man, on my bucket list, home of the Mariners. So I to see what's up, guys. I'm very excited. It's going to be a really fun and good time. And just hope you enjoy this one because this is a special vlog. Um, first time doing a flight vlog. And just, because who knows? Who knows when it'll be the next time? I'm not saying it's never going to happen, but... You just gotta take advantage of these things. So let's see what's up then. What does the hoodie say? Miss you? Dang. My right, guys, we just boarded. Almost time. So we got a few minutes left. Very excited. It's been nine years since fifth grade. Thank you, God. I'm right here. You guys have seen her in other vlogs, OG vlogs. You guys can see them, they're blocked from someone, but you guys already know my cousins, Jonathan, aka Juice, and Sarah's right next to me. So of course we sat towards the end. It's pretty sick when the plane's empty, walking back out. All right, for those who do not know, it was actually uh, Jonathan's and Sarah's first time flying. So how, how, what are your thoughts so far? What'd you think? A little scary. <laughs> actually, bro, no way. Dang, bro. It's all right, it's all right. At least you got the first flight out, out of the way. We got one more. All right, sir. Jonathan just gave his uh, review on his first ever flight. Now yours, how did, how did you feel? What'd you think? Wasn't bad. Okay, what else? A little shaky. Oh, you guys are chickens, man, for real. I didn't tell I was scared. <laughs> guys, don't worry. I got a Chick-fil-A here. Look at that. That's sick. Here at the San Jose airport. Something a little small, though, just for now. Got a eight-piece nugget. So, just a little something for the next flight. We could finally say we are officially in the city. Home of the Seahawks, the Mariners. Obviously, I would say Supersonics, but they ain't here anymore. Since when do airports have mascots? <laughs> No way he's playing that banger. For those that didn't hear it, somewhere over the rainbow. Hey! Alright y'all, just got the rental. Oh my gosh, finally we made it. This is such a mood. Just to lay it all down. All day long now, we made it. I'm so tired right now. I feel so good just to lay down on the floor. Gosh. Alright, so you guys can see Juice Jonah has his room already, but look. Look, look, at, well, look at one of the pieces he brought. Got that OVO. Look, he already has the shirts hung up everything. Look at that. He's already, he's ready. Got that OVO. There's another. Okay. That was in Vegas. Hey, guys, by the way, you're an OG of the Vegas vlogs. There it's, we go. It's yep. all a blur tour. Oh, yeah. 2023. No, honestly, never mind, T. <sighs> Nothing was the same. A little vintage piece. <clears throat> if you know, you know. That's right. OVO. If y'all saw some of those Drake shirts, only OG viewers of my vlogs have seen those shirts before. For those that do not know, I'll inform you. That's from Vegas. That's from the OVO store in Vegas. Um, I think it was last year's vlog. Yeah. My cousin Sarah, of course, that's on the trip here as well. Jonathan's sister. Got him those shirts at the OVO store. A couple of them. And those things are sick. All right, everything's closed in Seattle. So we had to get this, the classic. All right, guys. It's time to call it night. I'm about to start dreaming right now. So tired. We're all tired. It's just time to knock out. Um... Long day of flying today. Right now, the energy is gone right now. <laughs> Appreciate y'all for watching the first part. And I'll see y'all on the next one. Eddie, we are now in line. Down. What? Brush my hair down. Hold up. We are now in line. Currently at the world's first Starbucks. Crazy. Pretty sick though. Get 
This view is beautiful. So sick. Over there. Again. Mariner Stadium, T Mobile Park. Alright, guys, we're done with the market. We're about to hit up the cheesecake. Obviously, for the ones that know what cheesecake is, it just tastes like heaven. Y'all, look at this. Look at this. Alright, next stop, this sick mall. Two story Westfield. Guys, I take that back. It's actually three stories. What the heck? That's crazy. Found the lids here, guys, and just get, get ready. Get ready. And found some good cops right now. This part of Seattle, which is basically where the Space Needle's at. So beautiful. Look at all these lights. Alright, here's the Space Needle. Close up. This thing is so sick in person. Guys, there's one thing that I noticed. I have shown my face way, way less on the vlog than I usually do. But I'm doing y'all a favor though. But just got back. Um, I had a great time, thank God. Uh, first full day in Seattle. Try to show a little bit of everything I was able to show you. I'll show you actually what I end up getting right now for sure um, at the mall. And um, right now I'm just gonna chill the rest of the night until get ready for another full day tomorrow. Go show you a quick tour of the Airbnb and let's do it. All right, so of course, here's the front door. Right, it was pretty cool. It's like a little uh, place to put our shoes in and all that because the owner's Airbnb, <laughs> his rules are, of course, you know, no shoes allowed on the, on the floor. So here's the living room. Pretty nice TV, got some board games. So I'm, I'm sleeping right there on the couch, sofa bed. Um, pretty good. Here's one bedroom. This is where my my tia, my and my cousin Sarah are staying at. And they have like these, what do they call like twisted stairs? Is that what you call them? Yeah, spiral. Spiral, spiral stairs, there we go. So yeah, uh, pretty cool, pretty neat to get to the second floor. All right, here's the kitchen. Pretty neat, pretty nice. <laughs> Leftover fries from Jack last night. Uh, we currently got one of the, what are these, the complimentary snacks that the guest offers right there? Come on, that's not good. That the owner gets, that the owner offers for us. Here's another bedroom that John didn't stay in it. Pretty neat again as well. Here's the restroom. Got the washer and dryer in here. Here's the shower. Right here. The restroom. Guys, this thing is so crazy. Like, I actually feel tall for once because look, the ceiling in the restroom is like different. So here's a big mirror. Like, it's like slanted. So like, literally when I'm brushing my teeth, I have to like, for the first time ever, I can actually like, you know, kneel, squat. This makes it look like I'm, I'm tall. Hey, excuse me, miss. Can I get a, a chocolate milk with that, please, on my, with my tray? <laughs> my tia decided to turn on the campfire. Or what's it called? What? You turn on the what? Fire flames. Fire flames. Fire flames. I don't know why I said that. So yeah, she thought. <laughs> so yeah, now we got the. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, we got the fireplace. Makes the place look more sick. Okay, nice. Nice. Oh. Alright guys, as promised. So this this one makes me happy. This day rod jersey. Like, man. The whole plan though, I was trying to get the city connect. But of course, you know, as expected, it was not there because it's hard to find even the worker told me it's really rare. Even online as well. So I then obviously got the hat to match with it. Um J Rod's one of my guys, always enjoyed watching him. One of the best in the show, so Got to take advantage while they got them there. I got another Mariners hat. They're throwback ones. I've always liked this style too, so I, like, I got to cop it. And of course, I got a Griffey shirt as well. Griffey's my, always been my all-time favorite player. Non-Dodger, love to see it. And I found this, this beautiful Dodger sweater at the same lids where I got the Mariners stuff. I got this nice uh, Cubs hat from, there was a, this is one of the most recent lids drops. So I've always liked the, I'm a hat collector as well. You guys know me already, so. Uh, even though it's not Dodgers, I still like the style, the logo. And right here, I like the side patch, the be alert for foul balls with the cup right there. I love it. And then, guys, mission accomplished. I've always loved Fear of God for years and years, and I finally got my first Fear of God piece. It's a crew neck. You see right there, Fear of God. Really beautiful, chill piece, nothing too crazy. Just always wanted to get something to Fear of God. All right, guys, I knocked out last night. I couldn't give y'all a, uh, what do you call it, a uh, conclusion of the of the day or whatever? Is that what you call it? Or, or ending of yesterday's part. I got it today. I don't know what takeaway. What are we doing today? What are we doing? Taking your forex shirt back. <laughs> Guys, funny story. Oh my gosh. What the fear of God piece I got? I think fit me like a, a gospel choir robe. So I pray, hopefully, because I, I do remember they do run different. Hopefully that was slightly small. And if not, then it is what it is. I'll keep it updated though. All right, now we're at this one restaurant. That's actually came back to the market. It's like downstairs. Looks pretty good. I'll, I'll give y'all a review in a bit when I get my food. Yo, we got the view of the first wheel. But here's our view in general. So by the way, guys, happy opening day to those who celebrate. Of course, we got the game on while we're about to eat. 
I'm very I'm happy. I'm happy baseball's back. Really, really happy. All right, here we go. All right, food hit the spot. So now we're at a historic spot in Seattle. Growing up, I would hear about this place. You hear about this place, you know, on TV, YouTube videos, everything. Run the gumbo. <laughs> Bro, this is crazy. All right, how is this even possible? Oh my gosh. Like. <laughs> All right, guys. Check us out. His history. Like, like, had stuff. There's all these artists that kind of, like had like stuff. It, it was like, and they're like, this is a, you know, basically, I don't know. Anyway, it's not sanitary. So when you go to the game, they so this is all like. This is in a four-year span. Yeah. Dang. Yeah. Okay. All right. Y'all see this history right here? I'm about to join this club. I'm part of. I mean, I don't know who says only God knows when I'll be back in Seattle, but. It's been here forever. Are right, you guys ready? Oh, hey, where'd it go? Ah, what? It's right over there, there on the floor. That's the bullet? Oh, it's over there. Where? Ah, oh, yeah, should I leave it there? Or might as well. Well, yeah, you have no yeah, choice, right? Hey, I, I'm, I'll make it historical. Yeah, it'd be history right there. Hey, whoever, uh, many Seattle viewers, if you ever see this gun right here, uh, today, what's today? The 21? The 20, 20, no, it's uh, 27? 28? Oh no. Yeah, today's 28. March 28, 2024. Um, you see this gum? This color? It's like greenish, yellowish. That's me. All right, guys, back at the mall. And I just realized there's a Popeyes here at the food court. Literally, you guys know the chicken sandwich here is the best. Like, oh my gosh. God, it's real. All right, you already know. Mandatory. Dutch Bros. So happy. This is the best drink of all time. Best refresher. This refresher is better than all your guys's long 50 Starbucks names. Not 50 names Starbucks. Wait, how do you say it, sir? 50 names Starbucks orders. All right, guys, I got some bad news. So, um, I'm literally gonna have to stick with the gospel choir robe because they did not have my size in this one. Well, two things. One, I'm dumb. I forgot to bring the tag. I left it here in our place. I had the receipt and all, but of course, you need, you need the tag. But either way, I think it was a sign from God telling me that it's all right just to wear it, like, just to keep this because they did not have a small in this exact style and color because i for, again fear of god the way they run it it's like i know it's a style and i know it's oversized blah 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 but um but either way i didn't have to shrink this um i don't want to look you know like i don't want to I, I need to make it look presentable on me I, I need to make it look better on me so um i don't think it looks too bad though. What, what do you guys think so what do you think it Let looks know, nice so. it looks nice i could do a song like this oh all right, guys, might as well. Watching the Mariners, Red Sox. Shout out to Sarah for putting it on her phone. For doing that. What's it called? Screen share, right? I said screen share. <laughs> Y'all, the memories are hidden. We're, we're watching those uh, nostalgia Lord. TikToks. Oh, crap. I miss being a kid. All right, y'all, so for dinner, we got Pizza Hut. So hit the spot. We got so not a lot left, so. Pizza's finished already. We got the stuffed crust. We got some cheese bread as well. Pasta got wings left, so hit this. It hit, it's hit the spot though, for real. All right, well, something funny just happened this afternoon before I hopped in the shower. I was just messing around, so in the mirror right here, what I did is I um, I was because it was all fogged up actually, no, after the shower, you know, it's all fogged up. So, usually, what I do when I see things that are fogged up like that, a window, mirror, whatever, what I like to do is just I like to practice my signature. So, I was doing that, and I guess, um, a little bit earlier, probably like half an hour ago. Um, Sarah got scared because, you know, she's gone in the shower and after she's seen that and she thought like someone did that, like just a ghost or whatever or something. She got scared of like, no, that was me. Like <laughs> she got so like paranoid and worried of like, bro, who the heck's going to do that? You know? So I, honestly, I should have gone along with them and said that like, that was not me. It had to be someone random that broke in or whatever, but uh, she <laughs> thought that was a little funny for y'all to know. Guys, I just found out I could literally put the phone right there. I was going to conclude for this day back at it tomorrow i'm excited y'all will see what's up either way it's priority in the title what it's gonna be but just i'm very excited you guys already know don't be surprised why i'm there but see what's up then